Okay, so our agenda for today, we've already done fact fluency. So um, we are going to go over homework problems on page 15 that you should have tried last night. Um, remember, we don't collect your homework, though. It's just your responsibility to give your effort on that. So there's going to be a video on the next slide that goes through those homework problems for you. So you should be um, correcting your answers, making sure that you have all the steps worked out, etc., on your in your thin workbooks on page 15. So the next slide will have that video that will basically have the answer key with some explanations. Um, and then we're not going to do page 16 um, today. We're going to work through those problems later, um, hopefully when I come back. And then once you finish the video uh, going over the homework on page 15, um, you are going to be in your thicker workbook, okay, your lesson workbook. And we're going to do um, the do you understand, do you know how, which I believe is on page, let's see. In your thicker workbook, it's on page 56. And then we're going to do the practice and problem solving on 57 and 58. And those are all, so 56 through 58 um, is going to be lesson videos um, of me. And so that will be after the video for the homework problem. So today's going to be mostly videos um, guiding you through. I know it's hard when I'm not there to answer your questions. So I'm going to try to be really specific um, and, and clear uh, with each of these problems in your workbook today. If you finish all the way through the practice and problem solving in your thicker lesson workbook, so all the way through page 58, um, which is probably going to be a lot of time, uh, like it's probably going to take a lot of time to get through that. So if there's any time left, you can go ahead and start the math Excel. Um, that is not the expectation though. So like if you don't have enough time to start it, that is totally fine. Um, but if you do, let's say you finish and there's, you got 20 minutes left of class, then go ahead and start it and try it. Um, but if you finish the lesson videos and you got five minutes left, you don't need to start it. Um, you could work on spiral. Um, Mr. August is planning on hopefully having the spiral videos posted by Wednesday. Um, they may or may not be posted already today, but you can check. Um, remember, we usually try to post those by Wednesday. So if they're there early, great. If not, um, try it on your try spiral on your own the first time around, and then we'll send it back to you and you can use the videos then. Um, but like I said, you should be going through all the lesson videos. And then if there's time left, enough time, so I would say like 10 to 20 minutes, you could start Math Excel 1-8. That link is in Google Classroom. Um, but if you if the lesson videos take you up to like five minutes before the bell or right at the bell, then obviously you're not going to start Math Excel today, and we'll we'll find some time to fit that in later. Okay, um, I think that's it. So on the next couple slides will be the lesson videos. You need to listen and watch. So um, watching is not enough because I talk as I'm doing the math. So you if you do not have earbuds, unless um. Sorry, my brain, I got a little mixed up. If you do not have your earbuds, you need to play it out loud on your Chromebook with low volume, okay? Not so loud that everybody else, it's distracting, but you need to play it so that you can hear it because you need to have audio and video for the lesson videos that you're gonna watch, and then you need to make sure you're writing in your workbooks. So the next slide, we're gonna start in the thin workbook, which is page 15. If you didn't do the homework, you still need to watch it. Um, and then after that, you're gonna switch gears to your thicker workbook, and watch the lesson videos for the scientific notation lesson, okay? All right.